Hello everybody, welcome to Noah Inc. I'm Noah. Back in December, Aquaman hit theaters and I absolutely loved it. It's for sure my favorite DC movie and it's without a doubt in my top five favorite superhero movies of all time. So back around the time that, that came out, I had an idea for a drawing that I've been wanting to do for a while. I was riding in the car and I was doing this 500 drawing prompts book. I'll show you what that is real quick. And so basically it just prompts you to draw a random thing like a unicorn or a pirate or a box of chocolates or a brick wall. Or sushi and that's interesting because that has something to do with today's video so I was riding in the car and I found one that said draw a superhero and draw a villain and with Aquaman just coming out around that time I decided to draw Aquaman and King Orm here's the Aquaman that I kind of started to draw in the book I actually never finished drawing the Aquaman but while I was drawing him I came up with a really good idea of what if Aquaman would eat sushi now I know what you're thinking fish are friends not food quote some Nemo character. Anyway, I thought it was a good idea, so today I'm going to be drawing Aquaman eating sushi. So let's go ahead and get into the drawing. To start off the drawing, I'm just going to start by sketching everything out and figuring out what's the best way to have him hold the sushi, figure out what pose he's going to be doing, just kind of figure out the layout and how to make everything real proportionate and just make everything kind of flow the way I want it to. As you can see, I kind of play around with the different shapes of the sushi board. And right here I kind of go with a little bit more of a round shape, but by the end I kind of change it again. And I'm getting started on his hands. This is actually the first time I've ever drawn anybody holding chopsticks, and so that was kind of tricky, but I'm really happy with the way that that turned out. As you can see, I went with more of a comic book accurate Aquaman. I really think the suits in the Aquaman movie was one of my favorite parts because they were so comic book accurate, and I just really, really liked it. Because there's not really a whole bunch of superhero movies they keep the suits super super accurate they always kind of go off and make their own like movie version of the suits that are kind of inspired from the comics but they're redone to be more of a movie version and I really really like all the movie suits of all the different superhero movies but Aquaman just really did a killer job of making all of the suits look like they came right straight out of the comic books I remember seeing Black Manta for the first time come out of the water in that one scene and just seeing his big round head like it just looked so so perfect and the way that Orm's eyes moved it just all flowed so great and right here I'm coloring in his suit I was going to leave it just a flat color not really make it have any shadowing or anything but I felt like without the shadowing it kind of looked incomplete so I feel like I kind of had to add that and right here I'm just going in coloring in all the sushi I added little gray circles to kind of add the illusion of rice and then for the black seaweed I kind of added this little bit of like a dust of a green color to just kind of make it look like it had that green seaweed color. I had a little bit of trouble trying to make his hair look right like with the shadowing and everything. I finally got it to a place where I was happy with it and then kind of moved on to the next thing and went in with his hand just trying to figure out what's the best way of making that shadowing look. I redid his um, Aquaman logo on his belt because I felt like I wasn't really too happy with the way that looked at first and now I'm just adding highlights to everything. At the last minute I decided to add a soy sauce bottle because I felt like I kind of forgot about soy sauce being with the sushi but I felt like it would look really cool to have that kind of just floating in the distance behind him. It's not really in the distance but just kind of floating behind him. And now what I'm doing is I'm adding all these little like hatchy looking shadow marks. I really like adding those drawings. I feel like they turn out really cool. And I feel like the wood on the board turned out pretty cool. That was actually the most fun part of drawing the whole drawing. Just adding some final details to everything and that should be about it. And so that finishes up the drawing. Here's the final drawing. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know down in the comments what your favorite DC movie is. I know mine's Batman vs. Superman. No, it's Aquaman. Also, let me know if you think Aquaman would actually eat sushi. Thank you guys so much for watching. Also, don't forget to check out my Instagram. And please like and subscribe. Thank you guys for watching. God bless.